Hey guys, it's Annie, and if you've been around for a while, you may or may not know that I'm very much into the law of attraction and going after what you really want in life. You may have seen my vision board videos, and if you don't know what a vision board is, basically it's this board that you make that is a visual representation of your goals and dreams and things that you want for your life. Well, I've recently announced that I am going to do a video series this year going after the specific goals on my vision board. That series actually started with my Hawaii vlogs because one of my goals on my vision board was to travel. So let's check that one off the list. And the next goal that I wanna go after on my vision board is I have an acting section. This right here is my vision board. Right here we have the acting section. I swear this video is a law of attraction situation because as soon as I decided I was going to make this video series, I got the opportunity to partner with a website called allcasting.com. Allcasting.com is a casting platform. All right guys, got my laptop right here. I thought I would get close and personal for a little tour of the website. I will put a screenshot so you can see what I'm seeing. All right, so I have my all casting profile set up now. Put in my stats, what I'm interested in, acting, modeling, haha, I'm 5'4". Reality TV, theater, singing, promo events, voiceover, but my main thing I'm focused on is film and commercial acting because that's what sounds the most intriguing to me. So they have a ton of different casting calls. There are paid casting calls, there are non-paid ones, which I'm totally going to apply to because it's important when you start out in acting to build your resume, uh, get the experience on set, be comfortable in front of a camera, but there are paid gigs and I am totally going to apply to those as well because you never know, I could get picked for that as well. I'm pretty much just gonna apply to anything that I fit into the role of. What else, classroom. I have an unlimited profile. I don't know if this is just for unlimited or what, but there are these lessons where I can learn a whole lot of stuff about acting in the industry, tips for your acting auditions, how to make a good self-tape audition. I've never done that, I should probably read that. There's a ton of good things in here. Another really cool thing about this is it's not just for LA. Like when I go visit my parents, I can apply for things up there like in Seattle and Portland. There's theater, there are local commercials, um, there are shows that just film on location all over the US. So it's not just for LA, it's awesome. And I'm really excited to dive into this. Basically, it's a way to submit yourself to casting calls without needing an agent. It's great. Once my profile was set up, the next thing I needed were some updated headshots and photos in general for my profile. Yeah, you can go hire a headshot photographer, but since I'm just getting started once again, I have a really good camera, very professional camera for headshots. I myself have taken headshots for people, but I can't take photos of myself, so as long as I set the camera settings and instruct my friends who are well able to take photos of me, I was able to get some pretty good images. Okay, so we're taking photos. So this is our number one spot. So far, these are what we have. I think it's a really good start, except some of them where I look not that great. <laughs> With headshots and especially in allcasting.com, you want a wide variety of photos. So your general close-up headshots, smiling, different expressions, full body shots, different angles, different looks, your age range, so how young you can look, how old you can look, basically all the different looks that you're capable of, etc. Also, you do not want them super photoshopped or have a ton of filters on them. Like, yeah, if you have a little blemish here or there that's not generally there, you can take that out but you wanna look like yourself. You don't wanna show up to a casting and look like a completely different person compared to the person in the photo. I like how this was going to, I'm starting an acting career to, this is how you can get into acting as well. I'm just trying to help in case you're interested in what I'm interested in. My main goal right now is to just build not only my resume, but my confidence because this terrifies me. I'm not joking. It's so easy to sit in front of a camera for me because I've been doing it so long. It's a different story when there are other people surrounding me like on a set. That sounds scary. So the more you do something, the easier it gets. I'm in this right now for experience and with that, I have been applying to casting calls. Not only the unpaid ones, but some paid ones as well. And I've applied to only about 10 and I have some really good news. It's happening. My vision board goal is happening. You guys, I woke up today to three different projects 
that want to work with me, two of which are paid. Oh, P.S. The first project that I'm going to be on set for should be happening the day that I post this video. So if I can like Insta story some of it, I will. If you're not following me on Instagram at oh my Annie, I will try to post what I can from it. This is exciting. Cool things like this happen to people in LA all the time, but the fact that I'm just diving in and and it's like things are happening that's so exciting to me one of the projects is for a short film it's unpaid and it's kind of like a featured extra role but there are some well-known actors and the directors award-winning and just well-known people on the shoot so i figure it's a great way to get my foot in the door again meet some people get some more experience on a set after being away for so long the second one was a pretty well-paid photo shoot for a clothing company and the last one is for like a women's testimonial style project that is for body positivity I sent them links to my YouTube because I'm like I'm all about that and they emailed me back saying that they'll pick the final people on Tuesday but chances were looking really good for me being picked and that's paid I'm nervous I'm nervous I'm very nervous but I'm gonna do it because they say if there's something that you want to do and it scares you you should do it so that just goes to show that when you actually put yourself out there and try to go for the things that you want to do, good things can happen. You can go after what you want in life. If you always wanted to get into acting, you can get into it. If you wanted to be a doctor, you can go to school for that. But the only way to accomplish those things is to start. If you're interested in joining in all casting, it's a great investment. I will link it down below. So with that, this is me officially announcing the start of my acting journey. Seriously, I've been wanting to do this forever and I've actually always been told that I look like different celebrities and actresses. There's always a the classic, you look like Taylor Swift, but I've also gotten Rachel McAdams a lot. I've gotten Hilary Duff, Scarlett Johansson, Amanda Seyfried, seriously, so many more even. Actually, leave in the comments, which celebrity do you think I resemble the most? Whether it's one that I mentioned or another one that I didn't. I wanna know because it's always really interesting hearing what people think. Honestly, I take that as a compliment. They are all doing the things that I wanna do, so maybe that means that I have the look for it. We'll see. Either way, I'm excited for this journey. Please click the like button if you enjoyed this video or if you enjoy my videos in general. And if you're not yet subscribed and wanna follow along on this journey that I will absolutely keep you updated with, make sure to subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you're updated when I post my videos every week. And again, a huge thank you to allcasting.com for sponsoring this video, as well as for pushing me in the direction of my childhood dreams because I clearly was too stubborn to do it myself until now. Check them out, I will link them down below. But that is all that I have for this video and I will see you soon with a new one. Bye guys, break a leg. Is that what they say?